Hi everyone and welcome to Maths lesson. Can you guess which is monkey's most favorite fruit? Yes, I can see that there are five apples, four bananas, two oranges, one grape, and one strawberry. The most favorite fruit of monkey is apple. Today's our lesson focus question is, how do I read and interpret data using bar chart? In the left hand side upper corner, write down the date, topic statistic, and our LFQ, which is, how do I read and interpret data using bar chart? We have keywords, interpret, Bar chart, data, present, table, frequency. A bar chart uses bars to show a picture of the data collected which means a bar chart, also called a bar graph, is a graphical display of data using bars of different heights. A bar chart must have a title explaining what it shows. Blocks must be carefully drawn to show the data. There must be no gap between each bar. Each bar must be the same width. Here, class A carried out a survey about their favorite activities. They recorded the data in this block graph. Now, which was the most popular activity? Yes, hockey was the most popular activity. How many more children like hockey than netball? We can see in the bar graph that the 10 children like hockey and 5 like netball. So 10 minus 5 is 5 more children like hockey than netball. How many fewer children prefer swimming than football? As we can see that 3 children like swimming and 7 like football. So 7 minus 3 is 4. Four fewer children prefer swimming than the football. Last one. Class A has 32 children in total. True or false? Explain how you know. We know that 7 like football, 5 like rugby, 10 like hockey, 5 like netball, and 3 like swimming. So it's false. There are 30 children in total. Here is your AFL questions. After completing the AFL, you can put a tick mark and write down SA. Your self-assessment has to be done. 
Class B went to the zoo. They recorded how many zoo animals they saw using a block graph. With the help of the block graph, you have to answer these questions. Which was the most common animal? How many more snakes than giraffes were there? How many fewer zebras than snakes were there? And the last one, true or false? Class B's most common animal was the snake and the least common was the rhino. Now let's check the answers. Which was the most common animal? Snake. How many more snakes than giraffes were there? 10 more snakes than giraffe. How many fewer zebras than snakes were there? 6 fewer zebras than snake. And the last one. True or false, class B's most common animal was the snake and the least common was the rhino. This is false as class B's most common animal was the snake and the least common was the giraffe. So what have you learned so far? We have learned that a bar graph is a collection of data that has been input into a virtual graph represented in blocks. A block graph must always have a title explaining what it shows. Blocks must be carefully drawn to show the data. There must be no gap between each bar. Each bar must be the same width. Here is your task. Choose your own task and complete it. Submit to the teacher when you come back to school. This is your plenary. As you all know that how to find out the quizzes, just go to Google, type and search joinmyquiz.com, click and open join a game and enter the game code. Game code will be sent to you by teacher. Hope you have learned how to read and interpret data using bar chart. Thank you all and have a nice day.